So, published way back in 1985, this is Hitler's legions. It's the German army order of battle in World War Two. So it starts in the early war years and it goes right the way through. What it is, it's a comprehensive list of every single German division, the units and regiments within that division in the whole of World War II. It runs to some 540 pages. It's well worth searching out. It contains, now get this, it's here at last is the definitive book on the organisational and technical aspects of the German ground forces which swept across Europe with such ruthless efficiency in 1939 and 1940. Seven years in the writing, Hitler's Legions is the most comprehensive reference work on the German army during the Second World War yet published. Now this was 1985 and it's never ever been better. Um, covering infantry, panzer, panzer grenadier, mountain, airborne, Jäger, light divisions, security, Luftwaffe field, Waffen SS and such miscellaneous units as Cossack cavalry divisions in the service of Nazi Germany. Each entry lists the division's subordinate regiments, battalions and its home station and provides a narrative organisational history from the unit's formation until the end of the war. Each also highlights important battles and other actions. In addition, this volume provides summaries of the important activities of each of the German corps, armies and army groups. It's contains, I'll get this, 3rd Panzer Grenadier Division, 10th Panzer Grenadier Division, 386 Motorized Infantry Division, Brandenburg, Parachute Panzer Grenadier Division, Hermann Goring, 1st Parachute Division, 7th Air Division, 19th Infantry Division, 22nd Air Landing Division, 38th Infantry Division, 47th Volks Grenadier Division, 52nd Security Division, 133rd Fortress Division, 143rd Reserve Division, 147th Field Training Division, Replacement Division, Staff 152, 358 Infantry Division, and that isn't even half of what's mentioned on the back of the book. As I say, 540 pages. A typical layout would be, I don't know if you can see that, would be the, you'd have the, I'll get over this side, you'd have the title of the particular unit, the composition of the unit, its home station at the time, then you'd have a potted history when it was formed and its final fate, whether it was wiped out in combat, then you'd have notes and sources and all, all the units are laid out exactly like that. There's no photographs as such to actually show you because it's all written text. There's very, very sparse photographs in it. It's just, it's really just generic photographs taken from various archives. But it is well worth it. It's full and full of text right the way throughout. Every single division of the German military is mentioned in the book. Well worth sorting out. That's Hitler's Legions, the German Army Order of Battle, World War II by Samuel W. Mitchum. Um, second hand costs you about 10 to 15 pound, but it is well worth the money. Every single division in it is listed it's got where they were formed, where they fought at, all the subunits within a division and their ultimate fate on the battlefield, whether they were wiped out, whether they were disbanded or reformed into, into another unit. Well worth sorting out. See if you can keep an eye out for it. It is well worth the money.